Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we will be cut it. We'll be going through this National Geographic Break Open 10 Geodes kit uh, with genuine specimens. Uh, let's see what's all inside. Inside we have a learning guide and instructions. That little thing for blue marble. Uh, 10 geodes. Some safety goggles. A magnifying glass. And two stands. Now, typically with these, you would uh, tap around it in a circle along the circumference and break open the geodes that way. Uh, we've done that on the channel before. However, some of these are very interesting. I'd like to cut, try to cut that one open as well. That's right, we are going to cut some of these geodes open. Look at that. Some of these I won't be able to cut, like uh, this. That's rather big, but some of the, these smaller ones I will be able to cut because I got access to a saw. So we're gonna use this saw to cut open some of these smaller specimens. And that one would actually be a perfect test subject. So we're gonna cut this open this way. We're gonna check out the inside of the geodes. Okay. There we go. You could try to play, but you're never gonna be me. Look the other way, what I'm doing ain't easy. Bloody ants stain from the people who deceive me Muddy ants break through the chains, go free me Looking for change, looking for pain Pulling a mob, pushing a train I'll never stop, stick to a lane Pick up the pieces and go rearrange uh, I'll be the best above all the rest Put me to the test uh, Expect nothing less, you check as I'm chess, what's happening next? Yeah. He got the venom, a tangible weapon, no coming in second. This life is a lesson. He got a new engine from pain, that's a blessing. New focus, no guessing, just bold an obsession. All in his possession, you got their attention. I'll leave an impression and take a redemption. Just kill no discretion. Your mind is a weapon. 11 11, it's time for progression. Oh! You could try to play, but you're never gonna be me. Look the other way, what I'm doing ain't easy. Bloody hands stain from the people who deceive me. Muddy hands break through the chains, go free me. People like sheep move feet, heard it easy You don't wanna be fast asleep when they ski Let us stand tall That one came out a little better And this one actually had a little bit of a hollow right there there you go, that, so there's our first hollow in one of these geodes. Next one. Now that is beautiful. Lovely little cavern there on these two. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Might look a little better once it hollows out and dries off, but very, very nice.
very small cavity, but eh, pretty good so far. right here that is very very nice Another beautiful geode. This one had a little cavity in it as well. This is the last year that we will be cutting open with the saw today. Uh, it's fairly round. I hope we get a good, uh, nice clean cavity inside this one. And that last cut, and that last cut produced a beautiful cavity on the inside for us to see. However, we did have these two larger specimens that just are way too big to cut with this saw. Even this one is way too big. And we're gonna cut these at home with the standard hammer and chisel method.
Well, I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but it rounded out my chisel. This thing is durable. I'll keep trying with this chisel, but I might need to go get a different one. Well, that's that. And it's basically completely solid, which is a real shame for that's the big for the biggest specimen out of the entire pack. Basically solid. So would I recommend National Geographic's Break Open 10 Shields kit? I'd have to say yes. I mean it is it it says for ages eight and up. I don't think so. It, it takes too long, with, especially with those bigger specimens. I think some kids might get bored of it. And it's really a once and done thing. I mean, you can spread it out and, you know, do one geode a day. But these, this kit says it's for ages 8 and up. I'd say maybe like 11 or 12 as an age range. Uh, but if your kid has better... Uh, attention span than other kids he might enjoy this or they might enjoy this this is a great kit it gives some very nice little specimens including some that have very lovely cavities in them but this is a very nice kit I do enjoy it it cost about 20 bucks but overall it's it's a, it's a nice little kit I like it So out of those 10 geodes, we got eight of them that had some type of hollow. So let's take a look at all of our specimens. 